two, three. As I go down, here he gets heavy for whatever reason. And I feel stuck. We're gonna drop, more fall in with this one. Take him down. And then get past his legs. Yes, sir. When I get past his legs, my shoulder is pinning him down. I feel he I feel heavy. Yes, right? Yeah, yeah there we go. Good. So I'm not gonna fight him strength with strength. So I continue to push my shoulder like I want it to hit that line over there. Hook down. Weight on hands, weight on shoulder, legs pass through, and then we end up on top of him. And then obviously we can do whatever is necessary from there. One more time, sir. Come on, you know. Feel a lot of heaviness. Drive the shoulder. Don't just fall down. You're falling in. Here. Shoulder heavy. Weight on hands. Slide yourself up. The body don't stay by his hips. Sir. The reason why you go to the outside is to the past. Yes. Yeah. If you go to the inside. And so on the legs, sweep when you drop your knee. Yes, it'll be easier for me. Yes, yes. Correct. But we are going to do an outside where he resists a slightly different way. Yeah. Anybody else? The right arm, as you drive around him, as you're going down, how are you keeping it? Well, I'm hugging and pulling until his butt about hits the floor, and then I, I don't want to say front fall, I'm not going to go full front fall. I'm still very embracing. Weight on, weight on three points, hands, shoulder. Um, I want to put a significant amount on my shoulder, uh, but I don't want to rely totally on my shoulder, so I can take weight off of my legs comfortably. Um, that shoulder you can be as mean or as nice. Yes, yeah, the more, the less I have on my hands, the more it's on the shoulder, right? Oops. Yeah, heavy is Yeah, come on, heavy is Jack. So, you ain't heavy enough. <laughs> Thank you. 